Welcome, everybody. I think that you already know for years, or probably noticed for years already, is that nowadays the healthcare uh, providers are becoming more and more aware of the impact of their uh, uh, practice to the environment. And also, more and more healthcare providers are, uh, would like to, uh, to be more uh, sustainable in the long run. So, Philips right now is the only supplier um, in the market that can offer an entirely sealed 1.5T 7cm portfolio. Um, that is thanks to our um, helium-free or blue steel technology. The blue steel technology offers very unique uh, reality in uh, uh, today, as of today already. It comes from three benefits uh, at the start. The first of all is during your daily operations, you can forget about helium. And second, uh, during the initial installation, uh, you can enjoy the benefits of easy fitting and also lower cost uh, running the system. And the last one is towards the uninterrupted MR operation. And we can go through uh, each of the benefits in more details in the coming slides. Here, as you can see from the animation on the left, which is showing a, um, a transition from a conventional magnet into our new, newest generation blue seal magnet. The most significant feature, as you can see, conventional magnets use up to 1,000 500 a liter of liquid helium, which is a scarce resource and is not a green resource, cannot be reproducible. And the new reality is that we only use seven liter of liquid helium. How do we do that with Philips? That is because we sealed these seven liter of liquid helium into small tanks. And with the uh, micro cooling technologies, we constantly cooling this sealed magnet. During the lifetime of this, uh, this MR, in the coming 10 or 15 years, there will be no sudden loss of helium, uh, and also no progressively loss of helium. That, that makes the, the, the really the breakthrough. Over the lifetime, you can literally forget about the helium. The second is that because that only seven liter of sealed uh, helium used in the system, First of all, it reduced the weight of the MR uh, uh, significantly, um, up to uh, 900 kilograms. And also, because of the, uh, the, the helium is sealed, you don't no longer need a vent pipe. So the, the helium uh, will can never uh, lose to the, to the atmosphere around you. Also increase the safety factor when you're using the system. And there's another benefit that during the installation, because of the no vent pipe and because of the uh, reduction of the weight of the system, um, this type of MR can be installed on other upper floors uh, of the hospital. Um, this will decrease the initial construction cost. You don't need to do uh, re-renovations uh, in the hospital. So it, it gives the benefit to uh, save, uh, save uh, your, your budget uh, during the installation. And this is another benefit that we can see uh, when during the uh, during the use of the MR. Um, there are circumstances when you're using the MR. Some, uh, for example, incidents like a an object stuck into the bore, or incidents of a patient emergency. These are uh, incidents that you need to be pe prepared and can happen uh, during the, the the regular lifetime of the system. A conventional MR, when such incidents happen, it will take around a week or even 10 days until the magnet can go uh, be uh, ramped up and back to operations again. And also, at the cost of it, the conventional uh, MR will completely lose the helium uh, from, the, from the system. This is a very costly and also timely uh, cost uh, uh, situation. Uh, with Philips Blue Seal MR, we uh, have a we have developed this so-called easy switch functionality that allows uh, you can ramp up or run um, first of all run down the magnet, remove the object, remove your patient back to safety, and from behind the console ramp up the magnet again. This procedure only takes about uh, one day to have uh, your MR 
back up and running. And also, there is no loss of helium, therefore, there's no uh, big bill uh, running after work because of the, uh, the helium, is not, uh, you need to do a refill. So that's uh, the, really the benefit and the significant innovation behind this feature. Here is our uh, doctor, one of our first of a kind uh, customer uh, in our, uh, from our uh, new, uh, new product introduction called MR5300. They recognize this uh, um, really helping them to save money and also be more environmental friendly approach. Okay, here I give the floor uh, to, to my colleague Young. Yeah, thank you, uh, Ben. Uh, so, yeah, I would like to take this further to focus a bit more on the sustainability aspects of um, the topics that Sven mentioned, but also a few other ones. So, uh, and we focus on further on forget about helium uh, and what it does mean for the environmental imp impact. The um, What can we do with uh, upgrading an existing system in the IB? What kind of environmental saving we uh, we can reach there? Uh, further, we developed internal Lee Phillips and circular ecosystem, uh, which I will explain further. And uh, finally, I will highlight the, um, the power reduction uh, uh, features that we have uh, implemented in our designs. Uh, first, back to the helium. Uh, as many of you know, that uh, the, the prices uh, and the availability of helium uh, has become more uh, more limited, and the future is also very unsure uh, about the helium um, uh, availability. Uh, and that uh, that means that the price will be more uh, volatile. And um, yeah, if you realize that for every magnet, new magnet that you build, you need at least these 15 uh, liters of helium. Uh, it is quite a burden uh, already environmentally on the on the helium, which is a natural resource. If we um, look to the to the solution that we now have with uh, our uh, blue seal magnet, um, we only need seven liters of helium. Uh, so practically, we need almost zero liters of helium. And for a refill in case of a quench or, or whatsoever, we do need not any uh, helium. So, over the, over, so initially and over the lifetime, the helium, um, con, uh, the, yeah, the helium usage is reduced drastically. And um, analyzers have shown us that also the the helium production related uh, CO2 rem emissions uh, have been reduced drastically by. Uh, up towards 1.5 ton per customer, even so, it's a uh, it's a huge impact um, by being able to remove the uh, helium actually from the from the uh, from the total uh, supply chain. Uh, the next part is the um, reusing your existing magnet. So what the animation shows here, it shows an upgrade path which is available uh, as a field upgrade. Uh, in which you can transform your existing Ingenia system into a uh, so-called Ingenia Evolution or Ingenia Elysian system. And what basically happens is that mainly the magnet remains on site and a few other uh, electronic components, and um, uh, all the rest will be replaced. And that means the covers, the patient table, the uh, not many other uh, electronic parts. And that means that, and further, we give another extra lifetime guarantee on those components that remain on site. So which means that the customer will benefit from an extended lifetime of your uh, of your uh, of that equipment that no new magnet needs to be produced because we will uh, continue to reuse the existing magnet on site which saves also a lot of construction efforts including their CO2 emissions and um, of course the, the transportation the lifting and installing a new magnet uh, of around 3,000 3, kilograms is also uh, all removed. Yeah? So the, the, uh, it, it really is beneficial uh, financially, but certainly also environmentally for a customer to uh, consider such a upgrade path uh, towards the latest innovations without uh, removing or replacing the magnet. Uh, next, uh, well, this is uh, also con realized or, or recognized, I must say, by uh, by our customers. 
where these are really impressed by by uh, getting access to the newest innovations uh, on, on their platform and uh, next to that securing their system for for their future because they can uh, work another 10 uh, years with that system that they already uh, had for around 10 years or so so in to in total it it um, it expands the the total lifetime of their system and especially the magnet in this case the other thing we developed within Philips is what we call a circular ecosystem and from um, from that circular ecosystem we are authorizing trade-in values for either systems to be taken into refurbishment either uh, systems to be taken back for parts recycling for service purposes either for uh, material recycling so we have three uh, let's say repurpose uh, channels that are established um, in our re system refurbishment program we are reducing uh, on average 81 percent of the original weight of a returned unit because we don't need to build another system uh, we also extend the lifetime somewhat so in, in in essence it means that we can secure a, a a reasonable usage period to another customer with that with that existing system uh, where at least the 81 percent is uh, reused uh, further analyzers have shown that compared to a new conventional mri delivery uh, a circular addition delivery uh, mr delivery would lower the, the carbon dioxide reduction um, of emission by 14 percent and it does include the the let's say the usage time at the second customers and so uh, including the patient scan um, so that means that uh, we not only provide an economically uh, alternative but also an an, uh, an, an environmental uh, beneficial uh, alternative and last but not least we also are ensuring as Philips that we do a fair bit on every IB system so every installed base system uh, uh, NMR um, uh, towards our customers and uh, in that way we avoid uh, what we call landfill and so we avoid that any components or materials or even systems uh, end up somewhere in a warehouse or in uh, in uh, yeah in, in, in the environment uh, where it is not further uh, used. So we have our channels established and our buy and back programs established to make sure that we uh, can take back all these units from the IB and that we have uh, uh, proper refurbish sorry uh, repurpose programs. Uh, set up to uh, uh, to re to repurpose actually uh, the existing content. Um, the next topic is about reducing the power consumption. So um, the first way we do this is with uh, what we call smart smart power management, and that is a feature that is built in, in which the scanner automatically switches to standby mode when the system is not being used. And this will lead up to even 46% of power reduction um, when this is, uh, let's say, standardly done. This is not a new feature, but something that exists already for quite some time uh, and has been proven to be very beneficial to our customers. The second way how we are uh, realizing power consumption is by making use of our faster data processing uh, protocols. And so we, what we call smart speed, this is an AI-based uh, data processing uh, method, uh, what means that the, the actual scanning time of, this, of the MR system itself is reduced drastically. And that makes that the energy, energy consumption, which is mainly related to the MR uh, uh, scanning time, uh, is also significantly reduced. And that uh, is uh, analyzed per, uh, let's say, per uh, clinical area. And on average, we are able to reach 32% of um, uh, power reduction in this way. And for some of the protocols, even up to 53%, which is, which is really significant. Yeah, so these are the, the four main 
areas in which we as startups are innovating to become more environmental friendly. Please use this also in your considerations in running your operations on, on how you can benefit from this as well and how you can also uh, use this in your own, uh, let's say, environmental uh, positioning uh, towards your uh, clients or customers.